Hello everybody, happy Saturday. Um, well, it's freaking cold out and I'm going to show you just how stupid Ford is and hopefully I can help you solve this problem if you have it on your phone. 2020 Ford Explorer, Ford in their infinite freaking wisdom puts a block heater cord here for you but when you uncouple it and you try to hang it out the front of your hood I'll just show you here you can't close the hood all the way so you can't use the command start because the hood latch switch says that the hood's open so good on you Ford engineers you dipshits um, this is dumb in its most clearest sense of dumb um, so I'm gonna try and find a place where I can route this thing through the grill or through somewhere in the front so that we can hook this thing up to the block heater and be able to use our command start um, there's like no holes through the grill here that go through the inside of the front of the radiator anywhere that I've seen real quick so I'm gonna put you guys on uh, hold here do some looking and when I found a route I will uh, come back and show you how you can route the cord on your block heater for your 2020 Ford Explorer if you've got the same problem so hang tight I'll get back with you here in a second okay I think I have a plan for routing block heater cord so it doesn't have to hang out the front of the hood. So my initial plan was to try and go through here somewhere. It's gonna be hard to see through there, but right in front of the rad, there's some louvers that move. So you can't bring it through that way because of those louvers. They're in down here and they're in down here. So that eliminates bringing it through any part of the grill. But on your 2020 Ford Explorer, there's a little hole here underneath the fog lights and so I got an old steel uh, clothes hanger poked it through the hole and lo and behold that hole as you can see down there comes through on the clothes hanger end and uh, not, yeah there we go goes all the way through there so my plan is to make this hole bigger, about a half inch, so that it'll fit the loom harness that's already here, I will cut the harness, feed it through the newly drilled hole, or newly sized hole, and then re-solder block heater end cord, cord end onto the harness. And there's actually enough space in here that when the hood's not being used, I'll be able to tuck it in so that it's not dangling in front of the in front of the vehicle so I'm gonna get to doing a little bit of drilling and cutting and snipping and I'll bring you back when uh, when I get going on some of that it's really cold here so camera life is uh, is short um, it's minus 48 with the wind chill here minus 48 Celsius um, I'll let you American folks do the calculation all you need to know is it's freaking cold. Okie dokie. So, I drilled this hole that was already there out to a half inch diameter hole um, just to make it bigger so that I can fit the block heater cord through the hole. I cut the block heater end off, um, three wires in there. Cut them in different lengths like that, just when you re-solder them together, you don't have as big of a bulge in your harness when you're done. Um, so I'm going to now tape the harness to my clothes hanger that I fed through the hole. I'll use that to pull the harness through the hole I made, solder everything together, wrap it all up nice and neat, and uh, see how we're making out. So I'm going to get the the harness ran through. I'll see when I get soldering. I'll try and set the tripod up so you can uh, watch the soldering. But uh, we're making progress.
Okay, so got it finished here. So again, for anybody with a 2020 Ford Explorer who needs to get their block heater so that you can close your hood and still be able to use your command start without the hood hanging out the front here. Take it all out of here, get rid of all the clips and everything. Get the harness, run it down so it's all loose up in here. And then you get, there's already a small hole here from the factory. I just made it bigger to fit the half inch loom. Cut the end off, soldered it back on. Now, tucks in there nice when you're uh, not using it. Flop it out, plug it in. Everybody's happy. Close the freaking hood. Why couldn't you have just done that to begin with, Ford? I uh, I don't understand what your engineers were thinking. But anybody, hopefully, uh, hopefully this video helps you out if you've got the 2020 Explorer and you're going through the same uh, frustrating experience as I was.